Welcome to the Bankers Masterclass Series in association with Casha Bank on the new rules of digital banking. I'm Joy McKnight, Deputy Editor of The Banker. In Chapter 4, I'm joined by Para Nebot, Chief Information Officer at Casha Bank, to discuss the new world of artificial intelligence, chatbots, and robotics. Para, thanks so much for joining us today. Uh, so there's a lot of buzzwords in my introduction. There's artificial intelligence, robotics, chatbots. How are they really impacting financial services today? Talking about artificial intelligence is too broad topic. That's why uh, we prefer to point out just uh, three main categories. Machine learning, natural language process, and robotics. Machine learning is the ability that machines have to understand what's happened in reality, learn from it, and then translate it into algorithms. We can use machine learning algorithms into risk models, uh, fraud detection, uh, recruitment process, commercial campaigns, etc. Natural language process is the ability that machines have to understand natural language, either a speech or text. We can find it into the Alexa or Google Home assistants, into Kashabang chatbots, and etc. And then robotics. We must not see robotics as a supercomputer, uh, such as the one that appeared in 2001, Space Odyssey, or the film iRobot. Mm -hmm. Those are super robots, and uh, the robotics uh, technique till now is far from achieved. We understand robotics as a way to help human tasks. For instance, we can think on a specific drone helping to a firefighter in a very dangerous fire, or in agriculture, we can think on a drone uh, helping to harvest in extreme conditions, etc. Could you imagine a drone that comes to your house and pick up a documentation for finishing a loan, mm. or just deliver you the last credit credit card you apply for? That's pretty amazing, actually. Um, and then going on from that, let's talk a little bit about the chatbots and also, as you mentioned, the Alexa and Google Home. Where is it really making or creating the most value? The humans we are used to express in natural language. That's why we foresee those assistants will succeed in the future, for sure. You'll, you'll have uh, assistance in your car, at home, even in your mobile phone with this, with Siri or other assistants, and etc. That's why in Caixa Bank we have developed the abilities to be where the customer is in those assistants. So today you can ask those assistants uh, for any query, any doubt about any procedure uh, about Caixa Bank. You can ask how to apply for a Caixa Bank loan. Uh, how to apply for a new cash bank credit card, uh, etc. We foresee that uh, the, the customers will perform their daily basic transaction through that assistance, and that will increase the customer satisfaction. Okay. Uh, and my next question is really around data. Obviously, there's been a lot of discussion around customer data. What is Cash Bank's pillars around managing that customer data? We used to keep uh, customers' money in the past, but today we are keeping customers' data too. So we have to base our data strategy in three main pillars, cybersecurity, data privacy, and ethics. Cybersecurity, stolen money, you can repay it. But once the data is revealed, there is no way back. So we are investing a lot to be sure that the data of our customers is safe. Second, data privacy. Now the new GDPR law has appeared, and that's great for us because now all the industry, we have the same uh, playing, playing field. We always have followed that principle, but with a common regulation, it's much better. And third one is the ethics in the algorithms. Well, I think that's the most interesting point at the moment, and it's the crux of a lot of debate and discussion that's happening right now. Uh, sort of what is your thoughts on really the, the ethics in algos and how they can be used? As you said, uh, ethics today is becoming a trending topic in AI, AI world, and we are investing a lot 
on that. There is bias in the society, gender bias, race bias, sexual orientation bias, etc. We must be sure none of those biases are translated into the algorithms because otherwise we'll reinforce those bias into society uh, because of automatic uh, decisions. Banking industry is an uh, industry of trust. Cashabank customers has given us the trust and we want to be responsible with that commitment. Excellent. Thank you so much for your insights, Para. It's a pleasure. So in the final chapter of this masterclass series, we're going to be looking at how social media is being used in financial services to really attract millennials.